Hello little friends, let's learn about sun today. The sun is like a big, warm, and shiny ball in the sky. It gives us light during the day and helps plants grow. The sun is really, really hot, even hotter than a super duper oven. The sun has a family of planets that go around it, and Earth is one of them. Our sun is just one of billions of stars in the universe, but it's the closest one to us. It's about 4.6 billion years old, which is super duper old compared to us. Hello little friends. Let's learn about Mercury today. Mercury is like a tiny, rocky planet that's close to the sun. Just like the sun, Mercury is really hot because it's very near to the sun's heat. It's like a little oven. Mercury is so small that you could fit lots of them in one Earth. Even though Mercury is hot, it can be really cold too. So, it's like a hot oven during the day and a cold freezer at night. Mercury doesn't have any air to breathe like we do on Earth. Hello little friends. Let's learn about Venus today. Venus is a cloudy planet near the sun. Venus is often called the evening star or morning star. Just like the sun, Venus is super hot because it's close. Venus is close to Earth's size. Venus has a rocky surface with volcanoes, mountains, even some big canyons. Venus is covered in clouds made of sulfuric acid. Imagine walking in a cloud made of lemon juice. Hello, little friends. Let's learn about Earth today. Earth is like our super awesome home in space. We have lots and lots of water, making our planet all blue and pretty. People, like you and me, have been living on Earth for a very, very long time. Earth is super old, way older than anyone we know. It's more than 4.5 billion years old. We've built houses, roads, and cities where we live together. Earth is like a wise old friend who's been here for a super long time, taking care of all of us. Hello, little friends. Let's learn about Mars today. Mars is often called the red planet because it looks red in the sky. It has two small moons named Phobos and Deimos. It is a planet just like Earth. It has mountains, valleys, and even polar ice caps. Mars has frozen water at its polar ice caps and beneath its surface. It has the largest volcano in the solar system called Olympus Mons. Mars doesn't have enough oxygen for humans to breathe. Mars can have huge dust storms that cover the whole planet. Hello little friends, let's learn about Jupiter today. Jupiter is the largest planet in our solar system. It's so big that you could fit more than 1,300 Earths inside it. Jupiter has a giant storm called the Great Red Spot. Jupiter has more than 80 moons. It has the strongest magnetic field of all the planets. Jupiter plays an important role in protecting Earth. Jupiter is a giant ball of gas and liquid. Jupiter has a very faint ring system. Hello little friends, let's learn about Saturn today. Saturn is known for its stunning rings, which are made up of ice and rock. It's the second largest planet in our solar system. Saturn is like a giant gas ball, and it's not solid like Earth. The planet has more than 80 moons, with Titan being the largest. It has a lovely pale yellow color, and it's famous for its amazing ring system that makes it look like a cosmic jewel. Hello little friends, let's learn about Uranus today. Uranus is one of the coldest planets in our solar system. 
It's the seventh planet from the sun and is known as an ice giant. Uranus has a bluish-green hue due to the presence of methane in its atmosphere. The planet is quite large but not as massive as some others. It's a mysterious world with a fascinating history of discovery. Hello little friends! Let's learn about Neptune today. Neptune is the eighth and farthest planet from the Sun. It is a blue giant due to the methane that paints its atmosphere a beautiful blue color. Neptune has the fastest winds in the solar system. Neptune has 14 moons and a fascinating moon called Triton. Neptune is very, very cold about minus 214 degrees Celsius. One year in Neptune is about 165 Earth years.